All right, hello everybody. This is a 444RR 24 hour game show Magic More Marathon. Just ended a few minutes, a little bit ago. I want to thank everybody from the bottom of my heart so much. I feel so honored that all of you came to this, a lot of you came to this marathon. It was a heck of a lot of fun. We had fun doing some magic game shows, a little bit of improv with whose line is it, anyways. It was a fun time. If you missed it, you missed a really, really great time. Um, I did stay up for 24 hours, but I do have to be truthful. I did actually uh, go to sleep for about five minutes, uh, about two o'clock in the morning. Uh, but I, I just kind of dozed off and I'm like, whoa. And then I woke back up and started playing some more uh, DOS Price is Right. And that really woke me up for some apparent reason. DOS Price is Right wakes me up. I don't really know. Anyways, uh, but I do want to thank everybody who came. I'm going to name off a lot of the people who were there uh, a lot of the time. Resor 11 was there a lot. Uh, Mr. Tim Wamizuna was there. Uh, Mike from LA One was there a lot during, I call it the first half. Uh, uh, Nick was there a lot. Uh, the Zachman 18 was there for most of the marathon. Uh, he pooped out there and went to bed. So I understand, though. Uh, you know, I understand. But, and, uh, but it was a lot of fun. Speaking of the Zachman 18, he actually took some video of the 24 hour game show Magic More Marathon. He's going to post a highlight package on his channel. I think he's going to post two highlight packages, actually. He's going to post one with um, our two special guest stars we had. We had XNK, or Xbox Never Killed, John and Avery. If you don't know their channel, uh, go check it out. It's uh, Xbox Never Killed, and they do music parodies. And also, the guy who does all the Magic Geek demos, Chris Ballinger, was also there as well. He chimed in for about 10 minutes around 6 o'clock Eastern Time, and it was he answered a couple of magic questions. It was really, really cool. So I want to thank especially Chris Ballinger for taking time out of his busy Magic Geek day to uh, stop in to this marathon. So thank you, Chris Ballinger. Thank you so much. Um, to all of you who came, again, thank you so much. I consider you guys my YouTube family, especially the Zachman18. Uh, I think we are really good friends. And as I, I messaged him uh, right after the marathon and, and said, you're like my little brother. I mean, he, he really is. I feel like we're that close. Uh, Zach, you are one heck of a dude. And thank you so much for staying up for most of this marathon with me. I'd probably say he was up for a good, probably... He was good uh, up for, he was there for at least 14 hours of this marathon, I'd probably have to say, or 15, something like that. So he stayed up for a while. Thank you, Zach. And it was really fun to play our two in the morning Price is Right. Uh, that was fun, too. All right, well, uh, just to give you guys a heads up what's coming up on my channel, more 24-hour game show magic, more marathon, or, I'm sorry, now I'm going to go back to saying 365-day magic challenge. Uh, more of the 365-day magic challenge coming up. I'm going to, tomorrow, leaving for the beach. So you're not going to see Zach's really cool intro for the 365 day magic challenge. Uh, this starting tomorrow, going till next Saturday, you won't see the intro because, um, uh, all the videos were pre-filmed and are going to be uploaded to YouTube as scheduled uploads and they'll be, you know, uploaded on whatever day I tell it to. So you won't see the intro. I'm going to be at the beach. You can still personal message me. You can still comment on any of the videos because I have my iPhone here so I can check my messages on my iPhone. I just can't do any interaction like if you're going to have live streams or anything like that. I won't be uh, near a computer to be able to get to a live stream. Now, I had something I was going to do during the 24-hour Game Show Magic More Marathon. I did one of them, but I forgot to do the second one. So as a special bonus treat, I'm going to give you the other fake call-in that was supposed to happen. If you missed the first call-in, it was a uh, a lady who wanted to ban cell phones who was calling on a cell phone. This guy was supposed to call in, and I forgot to do it during the marathon, and I'm going to play it for you as a special kind of bonus footage feature. So uh, he's actually calling my phone right now. Let me get my phone on, and we're going to talk to him. Uh, this is the 24-hour Game Show Magic War Marathon update video. Who is this, please? Who are you? Are you close? Uh, I didn't catch that. Sorry, what was that? Close. What about him? Close. I just hate him. I mean, we're all about opinions here, but why don't you like clothes? I just hate them. They're so constricting. I mean, there's a lion wear clothes, and a lion is the king of the jungle. So why can't I, humble citizen, go naked? Well, I mean, I guess a lion has two distinct advantages over you. One, you say a king, and therefore it's exercise royal prerogative not to wear clothes. Two, it's a cat, and therefore it doesn't have to. And three, now that I think about it, if you want to try to dress a lion, you can. But I guess what learning is life can be a little unfair at times. I'm naked. I'm naked. I, I, I really didn't need to know that. 
why? Why does it offend you? Mm -hmm. I was born naked. I'm going to die naked. I'm going to live naked. So there. There's nothing wrong with being naked. It's so invigorating feeling the hot leather of a chair or the cool wind from the north on your naked body. I'm going to have to cut you off now, sir. Don't you believe in free speech and free expression? No, of course you don't. All you believe in is free drinks. I'm naked is not a damn thing you can do about it. I'm naked and I feel so good. What about winter? What do you mean? You know, I mean, what about winter when the wind blows and it's really cold? Do you prance about like a ninny waiting for your privates to go blue? I was born naked, I'm gonna die naked. <laughs> and all shriveled up by the sound of things. Winter was invented by clothing companies. Clothes are unnecessary. They're ugly. Have you ever cooked in the nude? Nah, look, is this leading anywhere? Because we've got a lot of other people waiting to talk about real things here. Nudity is real. Open your eyes. Take off your pants. Come on. Come on. You can be a figurehead for all the naturalists out there. We have more members now for the first time since 1977. Nudity is back. And a lot of people are into nudity and really understand the spiritual side. What? I'm hanging out with loads of naked chicks. I mean, I see the fun in it, but I just think clothes have distinct advantages, like not accidentally cooking yourself when you're working on a building. We're not swingers. It's not about sex. It's about being one with the world. All right, dude, Groovy, hug a rainbow. All right, so that was the uh, special guy that was supposed to call in. If you missed it, uh, the, it was a lady who uh, wanted to ban cell phones, and uh, yeah. Anyways, that was fun. Uh, that was a fake call-in guy, so I meant to do that during the marathon. Okay, so I'm going to go, and I will see you all in a week. It'll, well, it'll be a week and a day. I'll be back then. Maybe, just maybe, when I come back from the beach, we might have a game show party. I don't know. I want to see how much rest I get at the beach. But maybe we'll have a, a special continuation of the 24-hour game show Magic and More Marathon. Maybe we'll have a game show Magic and More party when I come back from the beach. No promises, but... We'll see what happens. All right, so thank you guys for coming to the 24-Hour Game Show Magic and More Marathon. Thank you to the Zachman18 and everybody else who came. Again, special thanks to Xbox Never Killed and Chris Ballinger for doing the uh, video or coming on as my special guest stars. Thank you guys so much, and I will see you all next time. 365-Day Magic Challenge is going to still be happening during the week, and we'll see you next time. Bye, everyone.